My name is Monica Young, business fellow at the Meltwater Entrepreneurial School of Technology. I graduated from the University of Texas at Austin uh, with a degree in finance, and then I worked in New York in investment banking for two years before uh, coming to Ghana. My name is Noah Fonts, and I'm a technical fellow um, here. Essentially, at I come from a background in online advertising, um, where I worked as a professional software engineer for around four years. I came to MEST because uh, I, while I was in school, I developed a, a keen interest in social entrepreneurship, um, and I believe that MEST is on the forefront of um, uh, that field and is, is one of the most impactful social entrepreneurship opportunities um, in Africa. I chose to work for MEST um, because I was really compelled by MEST's model. Um, I found it really interesting, and I was interested in getting into the tech and startup space. Um, and I also felt that I would be able to use a lot of my experiences and my, ba my background in finance. Primarily, uh, my responsibility, at least in, in the application uh, to the job, is, is to give lectures. Um, but I found that uh, I spend a lot of my time as well um, working with students both on in-class and out-of-class projects um, as they develop their business ideas into um, real businesses. I'm also heavily involved in uh, maintaining the IT infrastructure at uh, both MEST and our incubator. Um, and usually when things go wrong at either of those, those locations, uh, somehow I end up being involved in it, which is a lot of fun. Um, as far as the incubator goes, uh, I've also been involved with um, some of those companies and uh, I tend to um, both give technical advice in terms of product design and product management um, and do code reviews and, and look at um, how they've built their software infrastructure and, and try to help them scale their platforms from um, sort of their prototypical versions to uh, robust world-class software products that can handle um, huge volumes at scale. day for me probably starts anywhere between 6 a.m. and 8 a.m. Uh, either I'll go wake up in the morning, go to the gym, uh, grab breakfast at mess, and then I ha usually have a lecture in the morning. Um, so that'll be about two hours. And then um, after lunch, I usually have meetings, whether it's with my students, my EITs, um, who have a question, or I can also maybe be working with incubator companies and helping them with uh, some of their strategy. And then, you know, dinner is at about at five, and then we go home, and I'll usually end up working on the next lecture uh, throughout the night, and that can last for however long. Um, they tend to be pretty packed days. Life outside MEST is actually pretty interesting. When I was thinking about moving to Ghana, I thought, oh wow, I'm leaving New York, it'll give me a chance to kind of relax, take it easy, it won't be nearly as busy as the city, and I would, could not be more wrong. Uh, there is something going on here all the time. It's actually incredibly exhausting. Uh, we have an incredibly vibrant expat community here, which is really awesome. There is concerts and you know uh, parties and events all the time, and there's plenty of opportunity to meet um, a lot of very interesting people, uh, both within the tech space and outside of it. So uh, I guarantee you will always be um, you'll always be occupied with something. <laughs>